about that time Assemble and talk No, no cap okay. It's a civil war You thinking you worthy You feeling like door, door, door. Smash that like button like hope yeah. Welcome back everybody We here Sluggy Real, Real. Summertime Four time Yes sir Right on Um Alright I got some things Little things I want to talk about Cause you know Spider Man overshadowed everything this week, but there is some other things that you know. All right, for one, Black Panther, the second movie, right? There's a lot of news going around that. The biggest news on it is um they they fully stopped production on it, shooting on it, and everything until next year because this chick. Um, yeah, I remember we talked about that. Like yeah, uh, remember she got injured. Yeah, 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 you were. Oh, so she had got injured, right? I was telling you, they don't know what they didn't know what the injury was. What we didn't know what the injury was. They didn't tell us, but then they came out and said it was um something with her shoulder. And then she had got a concussion, but the type of concussion she got is very like bad. Really? So like it's like career ending in a way. If it gets worse, nah, no, it's like really bad. bad. Like it's going. So, yeah, it's like so. But they stopped it basically till next year. You know, once she's ready, which I fully with. I hope she yeah, gets well. Right. Yeah, right. Like right. forget the movie, and even if they never do that movie, I hope she gets yeah, well. Right. Right. That's messed up, right? Like come on. Um. Two. Remember how he was talking about how she was gonna be the Black Panther? I was telling you that, like whatever. Then then that was like, no, nah, I don't mm-hmm. want to be or whatever the case may be. Well, then I heard rumors that she actually only wants to be Black Panther for one movie. She only wants the mantle for one movie. She don't want to stay Black Panther. So I heard that's the case, the thing they were rolling with. And then also in his new movie is called uh, the second Black Panther is called if y'all don't know, um, Black Panther, Wakanda Forever. That's gonna be the name of it. But um. It's reported that they're gonna introduce T'Challa's son in this movie, like as a little kid. You know what I mean? And then we know for sure he's gonna he's gonna take the mantle one day, right? That's like yeah, but where the fuck get a son from? They gotta bring that. That's what they're gonna have to bring into life in that movie, maybe you know, because he was messing with that chick. That was helping them. Oh, word. you know, yo, it was. It would be cool if if uh, Shiri's like Black Panther, and then she's looking for a new Black Panther, like. In a sense. Yeah, like she's just doing it. Like taking this, like just to like, I pull it down and so yeah, yeah. So I could get back behind the scenes. I, I like that. I like that she. I actually thought that was mad cool that she wasn't gonna stay Black Panther. I'm like, cause to me, Black Panther's a guy. Like, mm-hmm. and not to be sexist, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, yeah. I, I was all for Sherry stepping in until they find a new Black Panther. But just that way, exactly, until they find a new Black Panther, you know. Right. But the fact that his son could be the Black Panther one day, that's like amazing. I think that's mad cool. That story, that's great art building and fan service. Nice. Um, another thing they have, they're doing spin offs for Black Panthers having three spin off shows on Disney Plus. Uh, one of them is called, I think, just uh, Wakanda Forever, like alone, if I'm not mistaken. But, I'm yeah, then, um, then there's two other ones. But what I wanted to touch on is Okoye, she's getting her show, she's getting yeah, her show. Yeah, Okoye talked about that. She, uh, I think, I think no, I no, 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 not the show. I'm just saying her being like, oh, I got it. Her like a movie and shit like that. Well, she's getting her own show. That's dope, see? They're going to start yeah. produ- production in 2023 and then they're finishing it. I mean, it should uh, come out, sorry. It's, it's set to release in 2024, but they start production in 2023. So it's not happening in Norfolk, but we know down the line she's getting her own joint. That's what matters. The Dora Milaje and everything, they, the girls go crazy. If I show her beforehand, because she's yeah, how, she, yeah, how she got into that. She's top tier. That's pretty exciting. So I'm definitely looking forward to that because they get it popular. They folded by sort of um, the fake Captain America. <laughs> right? Nah, word. They was different. Um, Another thing. Scarlett Johansson. She's back with the squad. She's back gang. Because I don't know if you knew that she was um, suing Disney and, and Marvel for that whole Disney Plus spill with her movie and they cheated her out of millions. Yeah, something about her speculation. They basically, that. in her eyes, they cheated her out of that potentially up to 50 million that she could have made. See, people be being greedy and messing up business. But... Honestly, knowing the whole spill, they the people that was being greedy though. Really? Yeah, they 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 try to sneak her. They promised her one thing, her contract, and then it was more. No, then they try to release it through capitalized off of Disney Plus because they know mm-hmm. everybody's gonna watch it like that. You oh, know? okay, okay. If people are able to come back to the movies, why would y'all even put it on Disney Plus? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah I remember that. I remember that. Yeah, so you she didn't get no cuts on that. No, no Disney Plus. Cuts. And they made more yeah. money on Disney Plus than they did in the theater. Yeah. So she's she was like that's up to the like, contract. Her though. contract was to get. PC off of how good the movie does, or how better right. it does. So it did good, but not in the theaters. It did good on Disney Plus. So, so y'all trying to? Yeah, I know. I know it was. Yeah, y'all was somebody. I apologize. Yeah, 
<laughs> Kevin Feige took her side. The Russo brothers took her side. All the MCU people took her side. Oh, wow. They stood in front of Disney like, you know what? We're standing with all of us. That's a fact. Man. And then um, they paid her. Good. They paid her out of nowhere. They gave her a settlement. They announced that she's going to do the House of Horror movie still for Disney. And then now they just announced, which I want to tell y'all, she's directing an MCU project. Directing? Yep. Not starring. Directed. So big Hansen. deal to say. Big thing to, to do. Big job. So... So I don't know what it is, but they just they just say the project name. They just said it's a project. So I don't know if it's a show or movie, but either way, I'm happy for her because she's one of the. Reach out to you now. Yeah, yeah, you know. And I've always been a fan of Scarlett Johansson. Even I always thought she was a very good look. I had a crush on her forever. And, you know, so she's a good look. Daredevil. You know, so Daredevil is reported that he's coming out with he's going to be in um four projects, four MCU projects, a solo movie. And then three other appearances for other people's stuff. That's great news to me because Daredevil's, you know, he's one of the cream of the crop iconic Marvel characters. So I can't wait to see a solo Daredevil yeah, project, you know? you know? See how the MCU does Daredevil like that. Because I didn't watch the, the Netflix shows. I tried, but I didn't get, I, didn't, I couldn't. I wasn't in tune with it. But to see him do it for the MCU, that's... Great. I know they think the MCU yeah, now. You know, it's what we they want. take so answer serious. Yeah, it's answer. They're gonna. They really gonna go crazy. Um, what else I had here? Oh, Spider Man. So Kevin Feige addressed the whole. Cause remember when um, they took Spider Man out of the MCU like a year ago? Yeah, they for like a couple months. It was yeah. like over the summer. And then they made the deal. And then they made the deal work, and then he yeah he's back. Or well, they addressed it. They asked him about it, and he was like, "We have no intentions of him leaving the MCU no more." He's not ours, of course not, but the, the deal and the relationship that me and that Disney, Marvel, and um, Sony yeah. has right now, so dope. I guess whatever they worked out, it's more in depth, and they have plans of Tom staying and Spider-Man staying in the MCU, so whatever they're building for their Sony-verse, that's cool, but as far as Tom, he's never gonna, from what Kevin Feige was saying, he's, they don't plan on him going nowhere, he's staying here in game, so that's cool, I like that. With that good confirmation. Mm. How you feel about it? Uh, I feel like that's good because initially growing up with all these movies, I'm tired of them even like DC. I'm tired of them doing new characters, like redoing the same. You know, you get this Batman again, and it's like, all right, now you're doing it again. We got a new Batman. You know, I'm, I'm kind of tired yeah, of that yeah, because yeah, I want to exactly. see. Oh, I already got. Want to grow with these characters? Yeah, yeah, like, you know, like, and, then, and then some of them be actually good. So it's like, what, what do you. Yeah, you, we start liking for yeah, two, yeah, three yeah. movies or two movies, and y'all reboot them. You no, know, yeah. Spider Man, prime example, though. So yeah, yeah. now it makes sense. Y'all better put them all together, I guess. Now, yeah. Because now, early I was, I don't know, but you might as well, yeah. because why the fuck y'all did this one time? <laughs> but not to know your soundtrack. But oh, that's dope then. That's great news because he should be in it. He is obviously the best Spider Man. It took me a while to grow. Because I was biased about the Homecoming shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, but, Homecoming, Homecoming was a great introduction for him. It wasn't the best Spider-Man movie, so I could understand yeah, that. Yeah, but, you know, he ended up... That's great. That's great news. That's what I can say. Some of that, that's great news. We want to see him here on out. More villains. Anything you... Name it. Anything happen. All right. Um. Also, with Spider-Man, to keep touching on him, there's a lot of Spider-Man news going on. Yeah, it's just, His, it's um... Good. Well, before we say that, Tom said that himself, Tom Holland said that he thinks, like, he shouldn't play Spider-Man past 30 years old. And then he's like, he also feel like they should do um, Milo should be next. How old is he right now? You know, I don't know. He should be in his um, early twenties though. Like twenty three, maybe twenty three tops. I would say. Yeah, that's good. Then that's fair because that's understandable. And also, um, you do want to give Miles a shot, right? Yeah, Miles. gonna probably take the. But by then, it'd be. I think they already got plans to put Miles out. I think that's just him causing a. What do you call it when there's a, a, a diversion? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Literally, but. All right. Well. But I think, yeah, I think Miles is in, I told people, I think Miles is going to be in this movie somehow, some way. And he shows him at the end of one of those. Mm -hmm. just... So, yeah, you know, they mentioned him in the homecoming and shit. They didn't show him in the crowd one time at the end? No. Was it at the show in the studio? He, he, said, he said it was Miles, right? Black dude. Or, so, or was it, is it, am I mistaken for amazing? One of them shits, he was like in the crowd. He was like, niggas was jacking that. Miles Morales. Oh, right, probably. I don't know, I got to look into that. Sounds good. Thanks. Um, Another thing, Spider-Man freshman year. You heard about that? Yeah, they're doing so like, it's gonna be an animated series, but based on our Spider-Man, the Tom Holland MCU Spider-Man. That's dope. Animated, and it's right. called Freshman Year, so you know, our Homecoming was, I guess, the end of high school, right? Freshman Year is gonna be Freshman Year. <laughs> wow. And then he's gonna um, he's had it's confirmed to be three seasons worth, and each season is gonna be, it's it's, it's gonna be 
used as fillers. So in between each of his movies. So from when he got bit until Homecoming. Second season, from after Homecoming, so Far From Home. From after Far From Home to No Way Home, like that. That's what three seasons going to be. It's pretty cool. So I'm looking forward to that. It's animated. Yeah, it's animated, you know, so Come on. that's going to be a cartoon, basically. That's the new best. Yeah, it's going to look like Y'all see um, What If by now. Yeah. I don't know what to do. And if it looks like What If, that's, gonna that's be. what I'm getting. Like. I'm but sure like, all of them. Because I was thinking more cartoonish, but it looks but like What If, like that's I'll be very satisfied. You know, that's good work. Um, Michael Keaton, he was on Jimmy Kimmel. I was watching this through the interview. He said, he ended the interview off with, oh yeah, I'm actually shooting tomorrow. And Jimmy's like, yeah, for what? He like, because they were already talking about the Marvel stuff and stuff like that. He like, Vulture stuff. He's like, really? <laughs> like, if you were wrong, because that, like, where that came from and, Vulture. all right, we don't think you're shooting for, to be in No Way Home. No Way Home is already wrapped up. We already know that movie like, comes out right. the next month. What are you shooting for? It's a secret project. It's a secret project in the works. I think it's a Sony project. I think it's the Sinister Six project we were talking about. A Morbius must be a part of something, bro. If he saw him at the end, maybe. What? Vulture, right? Yeah. When he saw him, yo. What's up, Doc? Nah, I, I think, I think Morbius and Vulture is going to be part of that Sinister Six movie they're doing. That should be. That's something. why I, feel, I don't think they're doing a Sinister Six with these characters. Yeah, yeah, no, no. But some of them characters are going to be in that Sinister Six, I think. Not all of them, though. Maybe, I mean, what was the character? Do you remember, um, what was it, Amazing? When they showed the um, Oscorp shit, they showed all the. They showed. They oh, did show the Scorpion. Got arrested, yeah. They showed Scorpion, right? They, they, they showed Scorpion. They, they showed, showed Doc Ock. They showed a Goblin Suit. Did they show the Goblin Suit? No, he already showed Goblin Yeah, they, did they? Show? No, no, no. They showed Goblin Suit. Yeah, they showed um, They showed that. They showed, like, some mist. It was some. Sh um, it was called. I think it was called Silk, if I'm not mistaken. That villain. They could, they, but they showed like ones that we knew. It was like Vulture. Yeah, they showed a couple. It was of Vulture. Them. It was Scorpion. Yeah. It was Doc Ock. So we knew that the Sinister Six was coming. And the Rhino had they released the Rhino at the end of that. That was the yeah. But they folded right Rhino. Yeah. yeah, you saw the Rhino off side of the suit, and then they didn't show us like him, which I wasn't a fan of that suit. Yeah, that I wanted Rhino to hard. fight anyway. I wanted to get away. But I didn't like that Rhino. Yeah, period. my uncle was commenting on my post the day. He's like, yeah, they put this Rhino in it, and he showed he put a pic of the oh, the original Rhino, the, the man looking Rhino. I'm yeah, like, yeah. that's the Rhino they need to put in here. Like, that's yeah. Rhino, bro. I didn't lose a fan of that robotic Rhino. Yeah, yeah that wasn't yeah. it for me. Mm -hmm. Um. So yeah, I you know, I like Michael Keaton. He's a good ass actor, by the way, one of my favorite actors, and see him come back as Vulture would be great. So I'm excited about that. Any um anything you, you that that across your plate lately that you just wanna throw in here? Um Sean Key. What you doing? What was that? Oh, if I could run my ad real fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, you just think it's fresh on. And I just think it's just one time. Amazing, amazing. I seen it one time. Amazing. Um, I actually agree with everything. If y'all have been watching a simple time, go a couple episodes back. When Shay came out, he told me everything he felt. That's how I felt. Like, it's like the best fighting and shit. And it is up there with the number one, like, the solo movies. Yeah. Got yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Very good. <laughs> Um, I'm so glad it wasn't even on the humorous side. I can say that. Wow. Mm. And I mean, it was the girls funny, but overall, the Chinese girl, she's funny. And she did all the movies. Yeah, but overall, it wasn't. It wasn't like they dragged it with that. Like it was straight. The cops was no, no jokes. Like this shit was a serious movie, and they even Shang Chi apparently. Yeah. Like, I should have seen about that. I don't know. He was fighting like he was a regular Joe. Like my friend can't fight. Crazy. And nigga was good with it. No. Off the rip, I'm like. Oh, I didn't know this was gonna happen. Not to cut in in in, in, in the still fast, so. but when I asked, when I told you that he was one of the top five MCU fighters, hand in hand combat, do you see he, it now or, or is he not? He is, bro. He is. And does, does he get it a little? Is he more than Black Panther with the hands or not? Still not to you, because that's close. But for me, I will not like a lot. Black Panther. Black Panther. Black Panther. Black Panther. He fuck Black Panther. I can say right now. My fuck. He fuck Black Panther. He fuck Black Black Panther. Oh, rest in peace. And then um. Cap in him, cause just cause I feel my cap won't be biased. I gotta be like a good fight. But wow, he might be too much for Cap as well, bro. And shit like that. Like he might throw Cap off. He might throw Cap off. Cause but Cap is folding anybody. No, but I mean Cap, Cap is my man. Come on, bro. That's my man. You don't know. But like, yo, he gonna give us some trouble, bro. I'm not even gonna lie to you, bro. Nah, yeah, yeah, I ain't gonna lie to my dog. I ain't gonna watch it again. Shang Chi is really good. It definitely was better than Eternals. But I just enjoyed Eternals. I was just more excited for Eternals because I like sci-fi movies, but yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I'm saying she's overall better than Eternals in every aspect. Nah, no, OD good, bro. And um, yeah, it's just really cool. Um, what you thought of the rings themselves? 
I think those that was pretty interesting too. It was powerful. They didn't use them in a corny way. It was pretty cool. Um, mm -hmm. I just feel like, but that's like how they always do movies. They give niggas they like true power at the end. Like he didn't have it to the end, so he didn't really see what he could do with them. But you got to see. But you got to see what they could do. Yeah, that's what I'm sure. That's what I basically mean. do his father do, but better. Yeah, because he really good with his. Yeah. Like, but his sister, I like his sister. Yo, but by she's way, good. She, I, she's my. New MCU crush. Like, yeah, like, I, I, she was nice good, to me, yeah. and then the fact that she was such a badass, but yeah, I, yeah, it made me like her even more, crush on her more. Like, she was just like, she had her stuff together. Yeah, like, she and she was in her bag. Together. Like, she was not with it. She was fucking shit up. It's a good movie, bro. Wow. What you thought of the, um, the end scene, the whole final act with the, with the dragons and everything? Oh, wow. Amazing. When they did that, I said, yo, this this is different. Nah, yo, he's really good, bro. If I look like regular person. Huh? It's like, I like motor, right? Oh, no, yeah. I, actually, yeah, I just read on that. The rings and stuff and all of that, that whole heritage shit gives a person immortality. No, it does. It does. Yeah. That's but, why his dad um, lived through all those... Um, that, um, no, he said he was like, he kept saying, I'm like a thousand years old. Yeah, yeah, exactly. He kept being like that. But besides that, I mean, he's a regular Joe. And he didn't find the rings yeah. without the rings. Yeah, yeah, he was he just, Well, then again, he's kind of... He already got changed the, that, though. Not to cut you off, bro. No, no, no. His mom is very in the mythical. No, yeah, his mom's just and, kind of from another dimension. And that's his mom, and he got he he. She said you got the heart of the dragon. Yep. That nigga was under the water. The so, dragon. So he's not water. a regular Joe. He is kind of a regular, nah, regular Joe, bro. It's something more with him. He just don't know his chi. Like yeah, he don't know. You know when his family come across that? They said that shit was before. Nah, see, how long had the thousand years? Well, that shit been around more than thousands than that. Yeah, that's why I think the end credit scene had to do with the Eternals. Cause I agree with that too. Because he said from past five thousand years, and they've been around for seven thousand years, and. You know, when they start helping humans and stuff for sure, you just, it, it lines up with tech that they never seen before. No, nah, yeah. That's but true. I think I think that beacon it was sending at the end credit scene, that message, it was sending out to the cosmos, but to the celestials to let them know. Start the emergence. I didn't see the other credits. You oh, you didn't see, see it. I'm sorry. No, no, it's not a wrong. It's not a spoiler. No, 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 because that's the whole, that's just the, the, the point of the movie. The plot of the movie is the emergence is happening. Gotcha. You know? But you don't know what the emergence is, so I can't even, like, jump in there. But yeah, Shang-Chi was... Pfft. If you ain't see it yet, see it. And if you seen it already, see it again. I think it's God level MCU shit, top tier MCU shit. And also, my other knows is MCU yeah. name. But yeah, let us know what y'all thought of all the stuff we talked about in the segment. Word. Smash that like button, like hook, subscribe. subscribe every time. Sluggy real. Till next time, symbol time. Yes, sir. It's about that time. time. Assemble and talk, talk, talk. No, no cap It's a civil war You thinking you worthy You feeling like door Smash that like button like hope yeah.